What's going on everyone? Welcome back to the second channel. Today we have a video that ended up being way more entertaining than I thought it would be. I hope you enjoy. Also make sure you subscribe to the second channel and my main one, I guess. That link is in the description. Thank you. Enjoy. Kids meet a bank robber? What the f- What? What? You know the, the car they bring money mm -hmm. to the bank? Yes. What part did you rob? The truck or the bank? I rubbed the truck. How did you do that? I, how did you know all the difference between all this stuff? I watch movies. <sighs> <laughs> oh, this is gonna be a good one, chat. This is gonna be a good one. <laughs> what? Hi, what's your name? I'm Jesse. I'm Anthony. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. My name is Celine. Nice to meet you. Wow. It's very professional. Thank I like you. That, uh, I like that coat. You look very professional. Thank you. Okay, so what are we here to talk about? Uh, what do you think? Come on. You want your hair? I do. Come on, man. Why are we here? Because of something that you did in 2008. Are you a bank robber? I was a bank robber. Yes. <laughs> I'm not currently a bank robber. I, I would never do it again. <laughs> I was a bank robber, chat. Not currently. <laughs> I, so I, You're a bank robber? Basically a bank, well, kind of a bank robber. I was addicted to drugs. <laughs> I'm kind of a bank robber. I only do it sometimes. Drugs, now that's a whole different story. So it made me oh really, God. really uh, think kind of stupid. Why did you say a bad word? What did I say? Stupid. I did? Look. Wee woo, wee woo, don't say a bad word. I wasn't very smart. During the robbery, were you on drugs? I was always on drugs. What part did you rob, the truck or the bank? I rubbed the truck. How did you do Crazy. that? How did you know all the difference between all this stuff? I watch movies. <laughs> okay, well yes, I robbed a Brinks armored car. Society like idealizes like good heist movies like Ocean's Eleven or Thomas Crown. These are great movies. We live in a society, bro. We live in a society. Movies. I was kind of like too fascinated in your story. Yeah, it's probably not a good thing. What is exactly your story? I placed an ad like I was an employer for people to show up at the bank at the same time. And when people responded saying, yes, I'd like the job, I wrote back and I said, okay, show up at the bank at 11, make sure to wear a blue shirt, a blue hat, and a... Is he describing how to rob a bank? Well, to be fair, I wouldn't take advice from this guy on how to rob a bank because he obviously got caught for doing it. So vests. don't listen to this guy. The same outfit that I was wearing the day of the robbery, the armored car pulls in, the guy gets out and he's just doing his <laughs> I shoot the guy. Thing kind of walking by him and then turns to him, pepper sprays him, takes the money and then takes off. How do you get away with the money? I had a... <laughs> well, he didn't, obviously. <laughs> he, got he obviously got caught. A landscaper or like a yard worker's outfit on with a wig. I ripped all of this stuff off and I threw it on the ground in a pile and I had a totally different outfit on, okay? So what are people gonna say? Who robbed the bank? Person wearing the orange did. Da, 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 da. That's right, was I wearing orange anymore? No, no. you weren't. I was laughing. This obviously doesn't work. <laughs> Last scene, running like towards this highway, and on the other side, there's this little stream that no one really knows about. And God, you know what an inner tube is? Yeah. I went down, um, threw the money into the inner tube, got on my back, and pulled myself upstream. Went up uh, this little hill, got in the uh, trunk of a car, and my buddy drove off. I went home to my wife and two-year-old and 15-day-old baby. Wow. Why are you doing this when you have two-year-old kids? What are you talking about? How does this have more than 20 million views? This is a bank robber talking to children. This is prime internet content. What do you mean? There's videos on YouTube that's like, mm, cat says bleh, and that has like 100 million views. This is like prime content. Oh. Why did you do it when you were in such a good position? Yeah, why, you stupid idiot? I was desperate, and it was like we had this house. On the outside, you'd be like, wow, you know, he's got everything, but I was losing everything. How much money did you steal? I stole 400,000. I thought you stole 9 million. 
Are you not impressed? I don't know if he's supposed to be. <laughs> he's like, the kids aren't impressed that I only store four, stole 400k. He's feeling very emasculated right now. He's like, they told me the kids would be impressed that I stole 400k and they're like, that's not enough money. <laughs> he's not impressed. I'm yeah. not impressed. <laughs> Greatest video we've ever seen. <laughs> you should work hard for your money. Like, get a job, not like steal money. Get a job, you fucking loser! <laughs> right. I shouldn't have stolen that money. Wait, so you hide the secret? Yeah, it was a secret, yes. Like Spider Man, hide his suit? Except Spider Man was doing good things. Yeah. Yes. So, obviously, there was there's one flaw in your plan. Was that he was immediately caught and put in prison. Yeah. A week and a half before the robbery happened, I was doing a time run. Time is very important. You know why time's so important when you're yeah. committing crimes? No, I'm teaching you guys how to commit crimes. Uh, why do you think time's so important? Is it the math times? Oh, I know. If you're like going to work and you're still sleeping in bed, the time just smack you in like smack. I have what? no idea. <laughs> What, what are you, you guys saying? are talking about? So I did a time run to get from the bank to the creek, to the creek, to the car. Now I don't think I'm doing it in my head. I'm not doing anything wrong that day. This homeless man's like, hey, I know what that stuff is. And I blew him off, okay? What happened is this guy called in the police. It was enough for them to basically get surveillance and follow me around. Meanwhile- He got dunked on by the homeless man that snitched on him. Like, the crime happens a week later, and I'd gone to a gas station, thrown away a bottle, okay? They waited until I drove off, retrieved the bottle, tested it for DNA. Ding, ding, ding! I was caught by a homeless guy. This guy's so I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This is a bank robber. I'm, I'm fully allowed to say this. This guy's a fucking loser. Did <laughs> like, you think you would get caught? No. Why would I do it if I did? That's kind of how a criminal thinks. Mm. Right? Stupid. Ah, <laughs> you said it. That's right. Yes. Um, have you seen Batman? I have. And you know the joke through yes. masks yes. and stuff? He was a bank robber too. The bad guy landed. Bad in... guy? Am I a bad guy? Yeah. yeah, you're the guy that gets beaten up by Batman. No, yes. you're not. <laughs> the kid on the right is like fully on his side. He's like, yeah, I want to be you when I grow up, dude. I'm going to learn how to do this. Like, I want to be the Joker. You know, you get what you deserve, etc., etc." There, there. <laughs> there, there. Did you went to jail for it? I went to jail. So how long have you been in jail? I was sentenced to six years in prison. Prison is just like absolutely wretched Rough place buddy. in movies. Like, you know, what was it like in real life? Like when you watch a TV show, there's like somebody getting stabbed all the time yeah. or whatever. No, like it, it, that does happen, but it's not violent and crazy all the time. It's just so depressing that you can almost feel it. It's like in the air. That's something that they probably wouldn't show in a movie. Yeah. I remember that I used to visit my dad when... Oh no, wait, is he gonna say his dad went to prison? No, no. No, I don't want him to get sad. In like prison. No. And oh, then shit. my dad came back from prison. And what was that day like? It was the happiest day of my life. Oh, oh my my heart, dude. No, Noni. They were saying they were saying don't swear at the person that said stupid because the kid said that stupid is a swear word. Don't worry, Noni. <laughs> I bet you it was the happiest day of your dad, This too. kid is precious. What would have happened if you hadn't got caught? I would have kept doing other stuff. They would have gotten bigger and bigger and bigger and... So are you glad you got caught? Yes. Absolutely. Would you do it? Wait, is he saying that if he didn't get caught, he would have just done it again? Again. No. Well, you know why? The yeah. main reason why? Was not so much prison and that I got punished and all the, you know, things that happened in prison. It was that I was away from my kids. I cared True. about them, right? Mm -hmm. And so I started drawing them pictures, and I would send them home. I care about them. That's why I robbed a bank. And I knew they were because little, I but they'd look at the kids. picture probably for a second, and then they'd you know put it away. But at least they would know that their daddy drew that picture for them. And I started making books for them, okay? Like, happy birthday book. And then I would make stories, and I really got into drawing books. Well, when I came home from prison, mm -hmm. I just made my own books. At first, no one bought them. <laughs> But then I had one book that became a bestseller. I got really, really lucky 
and I was able to again buy a house so my family could all live together again. Do you make a lot of money writing books? I'm making more money writing books than I'm, I did when I was a criminal. These are based That's after my daughter. That's crazy. What are their names? Isabella and Lila. He robbed a bank, failed at robbing the bank, got sent to prison, wrote a book on how he robs a bank, and then made more money than he did making robbing the bank. What? And they're detectives in that. And they gotta find out. Isn't it sad he stole less money than the amount of subs you have right now? Well, he stole no money. He stole zero dollars because he was immediately caught. Who stole the cake? Isn't that ironic? It's very ironic. Do you think you're a good role model for no, kids? No. Uh, there's a lot to learn from people who fail. I am a great example of what not to <laughs> There's a lot to learn from people who fail. Oh my god, what a video, dude. I can't believe this exists on this website. I can't believe that we as humans have created that. That's crazy, man.